There are seven million unfilled job postings in America right now. And many of those are gonna remain unfilled because job seekers and employers and educators are out of sync with each other. The biggest concern that I have upon graduation is definitely finding a job in the field that I want to work in. Sometimes there's a lack of translation between the desires of the business community and what we offer as institutions of higher education. I don't think that the business community is necessarily frustrated with the university system and what it's producing. I think they just speak different languages. So the speed of technological change, the speed at which companies are coming and going and market conditions are changing, means that we need to be hearing from businesses on a constant, ongoing basis as to what do they need, what don't they need, how can we be helpful, how can we engage with them. You could take six months to really distill what you're looking for for one particular position in one particular industry, but by the time you're done, you're probably going to be outdated once again. We need a technological leap forward when it comes to communicating what's inside a job. JDX is a revolutionary new tool that's going to allow employers to better signal in-demand jobs and in-demand skills to education and workforce providers. It's a set of open data resources, algorithms, and applications for employers and their HR technology partners to use in improving how employers communicate competencies and credential requirements for in-demand jobs. I think of the Job Data Exchange as a digital Rosetta Stone that helps employers, job seekers, and education and training providers understand each other better. Well, JDX is a fantastic idea, and it's something sorely missing in the entire system. There's been several attempts to get this idea going. It looks like JDX could be the solution. Instantaneous information about a skill needs, job availability, what's needed to move forward. Open data about jobs means equal access to information. It levels the playing field, and it makes labor markets more equitable. Ultimately, all students in the system would benefit from JDX. I really believe that the impact is going to be limitless. I'm definitely excited for what the future holds with a tool like JDX and how I can use it to advance my own career. The U.S. Chamber of Commerce Foundation is leading this effort to revolutionize labor market information. But in order for it to be successful, we'll have to have all employers engage. And in addition, we'll need all the other stakeholders that have a piece of the talent marketplace, which is community colleges, workforce development, agencies, training providers, the HR community. After we successfully pilot test it, we will be working with stakeholders to promote its adoption and use across the country. For JDX to succeed, it's, it's really going to take all of us. But I will say that it's going to start with one hand being raised. Join us. Join us. Join us.